Well, good day, farmers, and how's she going today? So, we're going to do some more small farming, but in the uh, old family farm map here. I really like this map. I don't know. Um, for doing the smaller stuff and, uh, you know, more of the, not sort of antique farming, but a lot older farming, this is a really good map for it, so... We have got ourselves a new Chevy GMC pickup truck. GMC, I guess it is. And uh, she's a pretty rough old girl. She come with the farm, so... Whoa, we can even go underneath and look at her. Interesting. But anyways, and then we got our uh, farm all tractor here on the trailer, ready to head her back to the farm. Whoop, better put her in the right gear. Whoa, crap. And she's a, she's a heavy load. We got to put the jack up. She really makes the, the truck squad, eh? So let me just make sure we are locked and lower gate. So we also got her an all wheel drive. Because um, if you don't, this truck, she, she's a bit of a. Oops, my jack down, my mistake. She's a bit of a spinner, you know? So she'll go, but she's a, she's a spinner. So we. Uh, Lock in the all-wheel drive, and then she's a little bit better. This is a more realistic truck, too, so it tells you up there the slippage, right? So we take the all-wheel drive off. She's 28, 35, 39, 41. <laughs> she's quite a slider, so the all-wheel drive on, she'll, she'll drop down a bunch. She'll start hooking up, and away she goes. So, But anyway, oh, I forgot to put my gate up. That's part of the problem. Uh... He's gate nine. Oops, my bad. Actually, I did have it up, but I was pressing the wrong button. So, I think you can actually put green and stuff into uh, into this truck, which is kind of cool, and take that into the into town, I guess, or whatever. I do have the other GMC dump truck, smaller, older style one. I'm trying to keep everything old style, old school, old style kind of thing. We've got a. Uh, Man, this truck is just screaming. <laughs> We've got a an old corn uh, maize chopper thingy here to chop up, and it shoots it into our trailer. And we're going to take that over for cattle field, cattle feed. And um, let's get our truck back here. All right. Put the gate down. Uh, oh, to unlock the load. It's got a very nice interior in this truck, too. Nice uh, high-definition gauges and stuff that don't function, but they still look nice. So, the old girl off here. Ooh, just about run over the rooster. So, first of all, today, uh, we're going to do... Uh, Ooh. Do this corn here. We've got a couple of fields. Our old girl. I like this one. The gauge sort of works there a little bit. I uh, can't drive too well on this one, but anywho, uh, we've got this couple of corn fields here. I think I'm just going to do one for now, and then we'll use our combine with the um, uh, corn header over there. And why is that not working? Turn harvester, change tool selection. Should be working. Interesting. It's not really one to follow my. Interesting. Okay, I, I was already playing with this thing and it was working fine, so. Let's try again here. Interesting.
That is really weird because of, oh, I know why I'm so stupid. I haven't put it down yet. <laughs> My bad. Oh no, wait a minute. Yeah, I've got to lower it. Uh, hang on, what am I doing here? Want that one. There we go. Now she'll cut some, cut some stuff for us. Whoa, I don't want to go that fast. Yeah, there we go. We had to uh, lower it down. My bad. So here we go. I don't know if I'm going to do this whole entire field. Um, but we'll see uh, how we can do here. I should do it in the circular thing, I guess, but anyways, this will work. So one thing I'm going to do with uh, farming for a little while is not hire a herald. Do everything ourselves, so that means this, for instance. Uh, um, harvesting, plowing, cultivating planting, you know, everything that Harold would sometimes do for us. We are going to do it all ourselves, so it's going to probably make quite a bit longer... Well, I don't know if I'm going to say longer videos or shorter videos, but less stuff we're going to do per video kind of thing. You know, so like one video we might only get this field done off, and that might run into like almost a two-hour video, so... It's uh, hard to say until we kind of get into it, right? But I am full and I'm still cutting, so that's not much good. Alright, so I would just sort of take this over to uh, our silos, uh, bunker silos over here. And this kind of job, what we're doing now, you couldn't hire a herald anyways, but... Uh, Oh geez, and I'm stuck already. Oh, what a piece of junk tractor this is. No way I'll drive in this one. Isn't that horrible? And I can't even, uh, <laughs> I can't even push the button to dump because, uh, or to release my trailers here because <laughs> it's not horrible. So what am I going to do here now? Probably, uh, probably use the truck here, maybe. This must be a really heavy little utility trailer, because she, she, she drops down quite a bit. Well, that tractor's really stuck. Really don't want to have to reset it, but I guess if I have to, I have to. Oh yeah, there ain't gonna be no moving that. Now I got the truck stuck. Ha <laughs> ha! Figures. So <laughs> let's reset the truck. We'll reset this guy. Reset that guy. He said that guy. Now we gotta get everything all hooked up here again. Maybe I should be using this tractor. Actually, might be the bigger, better one for the, for this job. So what we gotta do first now is hook up our cutter. Then we gotta back this fella over here and hook up our trailer to the cutter, and then. I better remember to lower everything down. Like that, sorry. And then, we can turn them on and start our cutting. Oh, geez, I thought it wasn't gonna 
whatchamacallit itself to uh, to it there, but we're good, I think. It's interesting it wasn't actually cutting out that first bit. Hmm. I think if we kept going around in a circular motion like that, it should work pretty good. So I'm going to try to hit some high demands and still, I'm already full. Look at that. I wish I think it would stop cutting when it was full. <laughs> Just keep on going and that's it. So Okay, let's... I'm going to raise this thing up. Maybe that's why I got stuck. Didn't take very long to empty that out. Maybe we need a little bigger trailer. Which I do have a bigger trailer over here. got the, the chrome trailer, which is a little bit bigger. A little, little longer, I think, too, so... Should hold a little more, I think. I think, I think, I think. I don't know why it's not cutting this here. Well, it's doing it now. Well, maybe not. Oh, yes, it is. I don't know. We'll try that. There, it's <laughs> missing a bit. <laughs> I don't know. It's missing lots. Well, this is it's filling up pretty quick, too, though, isn't it? Now, if I had two of these guys hooked together, I wonder if it would start shooting to the other one. Probably not. It's probably not meant to shoot that far. Probably gonna have to go over the other little spot again, or just plow it in. I don't know what to say really. See him full again, and I'm just not paying attention. Double squish her down as we're going through. Sounds good. Well, Seem to get most of her that time. Oh, it's even getting extra free stuff. Oh, sweet. <laughs> I think it's because it thinks it's a. Uh, still fertilize there because I didn't quite get go over that spot I guess so it thinks it's getting extra but really it's not yeah I wanted to do more of the uh, farming myself because I kind of felt like I was doing too much per per episode of Farm Sim Saturday so you know, like this episode will probably just be taking off this field and putting it in for, for fermenting and then maybe using the combine to take that field off and then depending on how time frames looking we'll maybe see about planting stuff for, for next week, you know. So I just kinda felt like I was 
running a whole entire farm and doing everything all in one video and it just kind of seemed not right, you know. So we're going to break her up a lot more, but we're going to do all the farming ourselves, which sort of makes sense too, right? And these fields aren't that huge, so it shouldn't... Oh, I don't know, full again. Shouldn't really take that long, so... I wonder if that was why I got stuck in there so bad, because I had that thing lower down, the trailer would have been digging in, the cutter would have been digging in. Probably what it was. Oh, we're 100% compacted there. Sweet! This, uh, this tractor seems a little better. That one seems a little bit light, maybe, for this kind of... It's okay for in the field here, but uh, in the silo there, yeah, it may have been my fault. It might have been the tractor's fault. I don't really know. Look, I caught her at time. Whoa. And look and see what we're actually up to in here. Ten percent. Okay, that's not gonna go super too far. So we better we better do some yet. Can't hardly see the cutter there, it's so close to the tractor. From the cab view it is, anyways. Oh, shouldn't be too long chewing the rest of this field up. Trailer wouldn't fill up so fast, so it wouldn't be so bad, but. Oh, 
got a whole pile of money to real really work with right now because I still gotta buy some kind of mower. I also have this uh, game I started new here on hard so that'll make it even more fun. But uh, oh look I got through there no problem cutter still down. I think it is too. <laughs> See how that works too. You put the cutter up and down. Pulls your tongue up and down too. That's kind of neat, eh? Pretty cool little setup. What have I got actually for maybe a little bit bigger of a trailer? Twenty-one thousand for oh, what the heck? Shouldn't probably do that, but anyways, hopefully it'll work with this thing. May not. It might be too tall for it. Maybe we'll check it out in here and see. Oh yes, it doesn't like this for hooking to. Oh, it does too. Okay. Might work. I don't know. <laughs> I don't think it's going to actually work here. It's kind of dorky looking, but... It is working, but it's definitely not the right size. The stock stuff they give you in the game here is not very good set up for you know it's all big huge big modern stuff you know and I want kind of like old fashioned small kind of you know stuff Kind of cheesy. It looked better with that other little trailer, but yeah, because there's nothing else. Actually, might be better there. I don't have enough money now. Let's go back and sell this one. Maybe we'll get this one full first, and then we'll go back and sell them. Maybe I can get enough money to buy that other one. I think it might be better. And if not, we'll just go back to our old girl. These scraggly little bits I'm kind of missing here. I'm just going to go over it with the combine after and grab them. Well, that was a failed turn, so I'm just going to go down the middle here, and we'll turn and come up the other side. Funny it's not cutting it there again. Interesting.
Definitely taking a lot longer to fill, that's for sure. It's almost like I'm not far enough over or something. I don't know. I don't know. It's weird. Very, very weird. Ninety one per cent. Yeah, we're almost done, I guess, anyhow, aren't we? Really? Not too bad. full trailer. I think this thing is actually hooked into the tractor, not the... Yeah, it is, too. It's hooked into the, the tractor, not actually the, the cutter. That's interesting. Build her up. Okay, let's sell. I'm gonna get a 10.5 back. Oh, I'm s like another thousand dollars. Actually, I wonder if this one would be better. Holds more, but see, they're all huge trailers. They don't give anything. Oh, what's this guy now? 9,600 versus. Well, that'd be better actually. Let's try that guy. Only 10 grand. It's like dirt cheap. Perfect, maybe. You know, we're almost done, but anyway, it should be good for for next time. And it's a wagon, so it should. You're zoomed in here around this side, maybe. Should. Come on, baby. Oh, that's not gonna work. Mind if I lined it up, eh? <laughs> Perfect. There we go. Okay, that's better. That's way better. Actually, looks better too. Perfect. Okay. And let's put the cutter down. Turn them on. And go finish up here. It's working lots better. I really like that. Even turns really nice. Gets a bit close there, but it turns a little bit nicer. Ursus, eh? Got lots of nice stuff. Equit equipment.
This might be a side dump trailer too, I don't know. Hang on, perfect, almost. Now how does that work with raising it up and down? Oh yeah, same deal. That's cool. Okay, I'm thinking this is a side dumping trailer. I don't really know. It's got a latch thing you see in the back there, but whoops, sorry tractor. There goes that tire. Side dumper? Yeah, side dumper. What are we at now? 23%. We're only going to probably get 25%. Um, well, that big trailer we just put in there takes needs a lot of compacting now. Alright, one more trailer should do her here, and then uh, we can get our combine out, and I did sort of cheat there, I got, um, <laughs> it worked though, but I used the Dutes, uh, uh, Dutes corn header, and it works actually on the little, the far, 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 combine, I'll show you that in a sec though. Yeah, it actually fit on, I couldn't believe it. it looks a little dorky, but, uh, for all I'm doing, it should work fine. Just because that little combine is the one I wanted to use, but they don't, uh, they don't have the, uh, corn head attachment for it, so we had to improvise, and I thought, oh, this is never going to work. And I actually haven't tried it yet, but it fit on, and it started up, and <laughs> it ran, so this will be the initial trial for it, and see if she's going to actually work and harvest stuff for us, so it'll be interesting to see. big turn. Try to get a few more, maybe just this row, and I'll just run the combine through the rest of it, I think. Almost got a full trailer here. I guess I could just zip up some of this fake corn here and get ourselves at least a full trailer. Sure, why not? Oh, that was a horrible turn. Oh, 
Okay, I guess we're color good there. Um, go dump this, get our pack down, and we'll get fermenting that. And probably won't. I don't know how I'm gonna feed these animals yet, but anyways, <sighs> we'll see that when we get to it. Need a little bit of compaction. Totally cannot back up these wagons. Actually, why don't we just take this apparatus off here for now? There. I actually really like that little trailer. I wish I found it first off. Anyways, we got them now. Wasted a few bucks trying to uh, switch through trailers there, but that's, I guess, the way she works. All right, blanket time. I'll let her ferment. Now, I would like to... Park this guy in his in our shed somewhere. We got room. And good. Now let's grab this guy. <laughs> as cheesy as this is gonna look, it should work pretty good. Let's get this fella unfolded. Basically, the wings are too much, right? But if you just had the center part, it would probably look just fine. Yeah, it looks a little dorky, I know. But, well, let's see if I run over these spots. Does actually give me stuff? Oh, it does too. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's so corny. And too fast. Okay, speed two, that's about it. Now, did you get that joke? It's a little corny. It must be something to do with the fertilizer that still thinks that that's got a plant there. I don't know. I don't know what the deal is, but... But it seems to be working. Fairly large head on it, but she, uh, whoop, crap. My bad. Yeah, it seems to work. I got 30% in my tank here already, so that's pretty good. Can't corn plain about that. Let's see, get that again. Corn plain. Corn plain. I know, I'll stop. I'm sorry. Just thought it would be funny. <laughs> Well, I'm not going to worry about really all this fertilizer -y fields, free corn stuff here. I'm going to go get this stuff and then that bit down there, and then we'll head her for the other field. And I guess we're going to have to find ourselves some kind of trailer sooner or later here. Which I'll probably use that one we just used. It seemed to work pretty good, so... Right. Now, I own this field, this field, and I did buy that one down there. They're so dirt cheap, right? Oh, 
Well, that's making her fill up pretty quick. Oh, ho, 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 we're gonna need a trailer real fast here. All right, nine, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, let's go. Actually, can we use our dump truck? I wonder if it. I don't know if it's gonna be too high. All we can do is try, boys. All we can do is try. This will hold a heck of a lot. Oh, I should have put the spout out before I jumped out of that thing. Oh, I don't know about this. It might not fit. Might just make it, though. Now, what am I going to have to do here? I'm going to have to do one of these. And then back into a spout. Oh, perfect. Look at that. I'd say that's not too, too bad. You know, I'm cutting half his thing off there. But anyways, that will work awesome. Man, we're going to have to dump this quite a lot of times. Because <laughs> this is going to fill up really fast. Really fast, really fast. Of course, it's a cutter that's four times the size that it should be, but, anyways. That works good, actually. All right, let's continue on. We'll put our... I guess I don't really have to put the spout in, but... Uh, Ooh, that fills up fast, eh? Holy. <laughs> Only gone like 20 feet and we're already 40% full. It's just the size of the head on the signal, that's all it is. The head was to proportion, it would probably be about three or four rows and then it might be full. I see, I should have just left the spout. I think I will actually.
I don't know, the inside cab is just too close for me. I don't know what it is. I have a hard time watching. I don't know why you can't use corn like this for feeding your cattle. I'm sure they'd eat that. Imagine I can leave the truck there because I'm probably going to be full by the time I get down there and back again. Apparently it wanted to miss a row. There we go. <laughs> kind of wish the animation was a little better on the harvest end of this thing. It's kind of cheesy. It just sort of disappears. But I guess that's the way she is.
Oops. It's pretty getting pretty handy here, and eh? almost done. Holy, I'm actually having fun doing this. <laughs> uh, anyways. And we might all, well, I don't know, I was going to say, we might almost have a full trail, or trailer, truck by the time we're done there, but I don't know. She's going to be tight. Ooh, we're gonna get her all. Oh, nice. <laughs> that was perfect. Worked out absolutely perfect. Wondering if it's gonna be just a little bit too wide, but I think we're bang right on here. Excellent. Jeez, we might get her all in too. Oh, it's gonna be tight. Nine, 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 six, seven, eight, nine, nine. Ah! Oh, 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 oh. So close. Oh well. That's not too bad, I guess. All right, we are complete. Now these fields over here I don't own yet, so uh, uh, we'll just leave them as they are. And we shall continue on here. Now, what are we going to do with this head for now? Takes up a fair bit of room, but I guess it's not too bad. I can maybe just should fit through here. Oh yeah, just perfect. Because I don't know if we're gonna need that for a little while yet. All right, well, let's see what are we going to do here now. I guess we got to take our stuff out of the field here, don't we? And I don't know right now what's coming up for high demands for anything. I'm just going to uh, take this to the silo for now. Have a look-see here. Uh, 
Cornyn, two days, 21 hours. Yeah, I'll just throw it in the dewy here for now. All right. Well, let's see. Uh, this might be too light of a tractor. for this set of kind of thinking it will be I might actually see about getting a set of discs maybe whoa Nelly what the heck oh that might work definitely overkill though yeah I'm not liking this too much it's too big for this guy Okay, let's go in our Deweys here, and... Eight-foot disc should run behind that pretty good. Our disc should be sitting over there, yeah. Sort of smashed between everything, but... Actually, eight foot disc is probably too big for this too. In reality, it's probably more like a, a six foot disc would be better. That should work. Let's see if we can hold speed two here. I'm not really too sure what we're going to do for fertilizer stuff yet. Wanted to use manure, you know, but um, manure I don't have any much of or any yet, so I don't know what we're going to do for that yet. Well, I've done a lot of discing in my days, but uh, that's pretty much what it looks like right there.
try to pick one of those lines in the field and stick on her and then you usually come out with a fairly straightish row. It's nice because you can line the radiator cap up with something there if you if need be, right? Missed one little spot there, but I can clean that up after. No sweat. Okay, maybe it might be warranted to get a 12-foot disc. <laughs> a little bigger. I have to put that on the bigger tractor, probably, though. Are those 12 foot discs? 
Our harrows there are a little wider, 15 foot. Oh, we'll finish up with this. And we'll grab the harrows for that one there. Of course, I could kick her up a gear, too. Alright, we missed a couple little spots here, and I think after that we're looking pretty darn good. And we'll go switch and try our harrows out for the other field. And if you're not sure what a harrow is, harrow basically just uh, it has a bunch of flat, uh, what do you call it, platformy sort of things that come out. And with a bunch of big spikes, spikes attached to them. Oh yes, yeah, sitting over there. And um, that's one there. Let's just pull her to the other side here and hook onto him. Whoa, Nelly. stuff here to the way. Oh, 
All right, so yes, this is a harrow. See the big spikes on them, eh? And they just kind of jab in and sort of drag through and mix everything all up, and that's the way she works, so. A little wider. Definitely chewing her up faster. See, we can go a lot faster than Harold can do it, too. Like, this is me driving. Now, if I turn Harold on, he goes really slow. <laughs> that was, what, five mile an hour? If I crank him up here, going pretty darn near a full blast. Ten mile an hour, eleven. So it's doubled. Over doubled. Whoa! What is going on there? Huh. That was interesting because I never touched that. Interesting. I guess we could join those two fields. But, anyways. <laughs> Interesting.
Ooh, I might be asking a bit too much. Yeah, I thought so. I'll have to do another swipe down. Some little buggy back there didn't seem to like it. it. Seemed to drop for a lot of frame rate there. Interesting. Well, there we go, that wasn't too bad. Sure can't appreciate uh, higher and Harold though, eh? But uh, this time around we're solo farming. Alright, let's grab that other guy uh, around the corner here. He's got a three point hitch, yeah. This is going to take quite a while, I think. Uh, uh, with this size of cedar, I'd like to get something a little bigger, but I'd like to keep into the vintage, though, too, right? Uh, 
Not a lot to choose from there, except it's the big huge stuff, which I don't want to get into. Might have to go do some searching, but um, that one's three meters wide. Anyways, we'll do a field, I guess, with this one for now. What are we going to plant? Probably barley will be worth more. Man, that's just going to take forever. <laughs> uh. Alright, I do want to do it this way, but uh, I'm going to take a little break here. I'm going to go and check on the mod site there and see what's available for something just a little bigger maybe that's uh, still sort of old vintage -y looking. So, we shall return. Alright, so we're back. Check out this apparatus I found. Holy, it comes as a kit, like a dual thing. And we're going in the hole pretty hard here, but uh, anyways, uh, it's a little bit wider and it even comes with a pre-cultivating machine there too so I'm like sweet that's pretty cool ls2013.com just look up uh, what did I look up uh, sewing s-o-w-i-n-g and I come up with that now mind you I haven't tried it yet but anyways it looks like it's gonna work good Whoa, she's a little heavy. Okay, so let's put... Oh, wait a minute. What's going on here? Unfold sore. Okay. Uh, that's all good. We need to... Lower cultivator. <laughs> Isn't that cool? And here we go. Seems to work not too bad. Let's see if we can take gear two here, maybe. No, eight mile an hour, that's all we can do. Pretty handy, kind of two stones with one bird, right? Should work pretty good. There's even animation on the rollers and stuff, and the choppers, and Seems to be just about the perfect right scale for what we're doing here, you know, so.
I guess if we could, it's hard to sort of say with this big tractor, but I think I'm going to have to stay in the exterior view most of it here. That seems like a pretty good planting combination, though. I seem, uh, seem to like this. It seems to work pretty good. It's a good size for the sides of the field, I think. Oh, missed a bit. Try not to go overlapping too, too much, but... I'd be neat to see, too, if... Uh, the seed actually disappears when it empties out or goes down as you're using it. Now, just for a sec, I want to hire Harold. I know I said I wouldn't do it. I just want to watch this in action here. Oh. Harold? What are you doing, Harold? Oh, Harold, I can't, uh, can't be doing that, bud. What he, what he was not liking there, but anywho. Uh, okay, well, I guess that didn't last very long, so off we go. He's frickin' carving the thing out again here. What the heck? I didn't turn that on. Harold, like, must automatically do that himself. Come on. Go. Put her in drive, bud. Oh, now we're gonna really have a weird screwed up looking field, but anyways. <laughs> Maybe we better just join him. That probably wouldn't be a bad idea. Sort of looks like the seed's going down. Hard to tell. Won't, won't, won't know until we get down further, I guess.
I'm not too sure what I want to do for fertilizing, though. I gotta do fertilizing because, like, it uh, really decreases your uh, what you get out, back out of your field if you don't. It's amazing, actually, what it'll do for you. Eventually, I just want to use the uh, cow manure, but I uh, haven't got uh, cows yet, so. And we're also $3,600 in the hole. So that's not good as well. <laughs> we'll have to uh, maybe take our corn in or sell some stuff or something. Now, I wonder, can I still plant and not till this up? Because I really don't need to till all the stuff up. I just planted. Uh, that doesn't look like it. I'll have to unhook and then just... Oh, can any of you do that? Oh, yes, I can. Okay, so we'll unhook. Oops. Unhook the cultivator part. Actually, I don't need to cultivate that other one either. I just wanted to try her, you know, but I think we can just go ahead and seed without the cultivator. Wait a minute, I can't go any slower than that. Oh, wait a minute, here we go. Huh? Seriously? Speed one is too fast for it. Doesn't want you to go under eight. I'm right on eight, so. Ah, <laughs> let go. <laughs> that's so stupid. Okay, well, that's not going to work exactly the way I was planning. Now, fold sower, ridge marker, can't lift sower's V, that's what I was pushing. It's too heavy to lift. Yeah, it must be. It's full of seed, it knows it's full of seed, so it won't lift it first. Well, uh, what else can I do? So speed one is too fast. It's right on eight, but it still disconnects, so that's not too good. And basically I have to use four, which is like the coast along beside them, and it's too, that's way too slow. Okay, we're gonna try another. I think maybe this guy. Well, that's speed one. Let's get lined up here, and then we'll try. Whoa. Try speed two. Yeah, it's too fast, so. Well, that's about all we can do, boys. Should be good for the next time, though, that we need to, uh... Cultivate and plant at the same time, so. Ooh. 
Whoa, Nelly. What does number zero do? Holy cow, what the heck is all this crap? I don't know, I can't read that. Bridge marker doesn't work, that's nice. Just doesn't quite turn sharp enough for us. Ready. We are. Oh, we've got lots to do yet. I wish I could go a bit faster here, but she won't take more speed, Captain. She won't take more speed. This is a more realistic uh, harvest and harvester. Holy cow! <laughs> Planter, seed sower. 
So I guess that's a more realistic speed. You can't just go 10 bazillion miles an hour and expect it to seed, right? Interesting. That's number seven for... Oh, that's the tractor, I guess. Okay. It's got a whole bunch of stuff in there. I have no idea what what it is, but anyways. Yeah, it looks like the seed's definitely going down. At least if I could watch where I was driving. I think this tractor is a little more, the re re more of the more realistic too, because it turns so weird. It sort of makes sense. It's more realistic, right? So that's the way she works. I'll tell you, doing this all by hand, you sure appreciate doing, uh, having Harold do it for you. Wow, we. You know, like, I could have had Harold planting this for me, and then I could have been, uh, into, uh, taking that stuff into town, or maybe mowing some grass or something for, you know, feed the cattle some grass, at least get the cattle started, but. No, we're we're gonna do this video just a more realistic way, I guess you'd call it, right? More realistic. Hopefully, we're gonna have enough seed for uh, all this here. I'm pretty sure we will, but we shall seed when we're done. Ha <laughs> ha! Got you again.
So we got probably one, two, three, four more swipes here, maybe-ish. Around there somewhere. Don't know if, oh, if I went in further here, I might get it done in t two more after. I don't know, it's hard to say. Pretty tight. think we'll do all right. Got brake lights on this thing. See brake lights. <laughs> That's cool. And our last swipe, and we are planted, except we haven't fertilized yet. Oh, but I don't know what I'm going to do for that yet. I still haven't sort of really decided. Uh, oh, boy. Uh, well, I guess maybe we'll have to take some, some corn in or something first. Sitting funny, isn't it? It's chewing up my whole field again. What the heck? My lift isn't lifting. Huh. My old lifter broken on this thing or something? <laughs> <laughs> Something's not right. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here. It's totally screwed up. Maybe it doesn't like this tractor or something. Whoa! Oh, now we're good. Holy cow. But anyways, uh, let's go find a home for this guy. Whoa. That's not good. doing it again what the heck <laughs> oh man have to keep an eye on that thing all right well then I guess we're pretty good for that field um, our next task I'm thinking now fertilization yes okay so what we're gonna have to do is take some stuff in let's first look and see what we're gonna use um that wouldn't be pretty good there but ninety eight hundred dollars ooh boy Kind of don't think I got that much in stock. Well, let's just dump all our bins out, I guess. We'll start here with the wheat. I think that's the wheat bin. Wheat bin. And 13% is all we got. 
Well, we're on this end of the saloon, I guess. This should be a lot nicer if we're driving in here than all those uh, old trailers that are, you know, such a nightmare to back in here so tight. You know, there's 2,700 minus the three grand we paid off. Ready for super flying truck! Can you hold her straight? She's going so fast. This will be barley. Uh, too much of that either. turn. Oh, we got enough for that one. All right, let's just have another look. Any mods that we might have? I can't remember what I got now. No, I don't want one of those. That one's not super wide, but let's go with one of them guys there. All right, now this is going to be interesting because uh, I'm not sure what I've got set up here now as in fertilizer is going to be wicked expensive maybe and totally put us right in a hole that we'll never get out of, which I don't know why or what I've put in that's made it do that. because we'll see what happens here when I start filling. If it's going like wicked stupid crazy, that's not good. And if it's nice and slow... Oh yeah, it's going wicked stupid crazy. It shouldn't cost like 10, 12, 15 grand to fill up your fertilizer spreader. It's not that big of a spreader. Scary. Definitely don't want to waste it, I guess. Now we're eighty-eight hundred dollars in the in the hole again.
course, I guess the fertilizer isn't lasting too bad, though. It's one good thing. One more row should do it. Oh, we got that field to do too. And there we go. Now, what is that field? Uh, whoops. No, I want this one. Uh, barley. I, I don't know. I know what that is. But anyways, there we go. We are planted, cultivated, planted, fertilized, ready to rock again. And eighty-eight hundred dollars in the in the hole. Yeah, not too good. Um, I actually don't need that cultivator and all the discs and stuff now, but we'll, uh, we'll hang on to that for now. All right, there we go. All right, <clears throat> well, I guess to finish off today, we will go and get that other field down. And yes, I have got a bigger head on this thing. <laughs> this is from the big dudes cutter. Look at that difference in the size of these two fellers. Oh yeah. Can't believe it actually works. Well, so far. It hooked up anyways. Looks funny with the green and red, but uh oh well. Okay, and now oh, we're gonna need our truck again. But let's get a full a full load here first. Sweet, it is gonna work. And he's filling up quick. <laughs> Not as fast as the corn, though. That corn, oh man, that's fast. Now, I don't think we're going to have enough money to get any kind of a... Loading wagon. Uh, yeah, no. <laughs> Let's check over here just, just to say we did. Whoa. Loading wagons. Holy. Oh, we can get that one. It's okay. I like that one. Works good. Too fast. Almost got away with it, eh? Oh well. Speed two is all we can do.
Okay, off we go. I don't think it'll take us too long to burn this field off here. I wonder if this thing would take that great big wide cutter. That would be hilarious. See, I might still have that one. Oops. That one mod that was free. Just 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 for fun, eh? And it won't cost me any money. Oh, maybe I don't anymore. No, I changed it, that's right. Oh well, not a biggie. Whoops. Wrong button. My bad. I'm sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. Big grimy turn here. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Like one row left. That's okay. I'm going to turn here anyways, I think. Alright, while we're doing this, let's see, remind ourselves again when the barley, oh, I've got wheat, of course. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter, but anyways. I thought this was a barley field, but anyway, it's hard to tell, isn't it? Alright, we are full again.
I think we ought to have her in about another three, three fights here, maybe. Yeah, we're only 19, 20% in the truck. <laughs> Holy. Well, we might be stretching her, but I think, oh, you, you, no, I don't think we're going to get the last row there. Close, but no cigars. Can't tell if I'm loading, but anyways, that'd be really cool if the mirror actually worked and showed you back there. It looks like we're loading. Well, if the whole roll was that wide, we would do her. But unfortunately, it's getting wider up there. <laughs> so we're going to have to probably do another half a swipe back, I'm guessing. I can almost get her all there.
And that is her. And I guess I better take this in and get what money I can get for it. I can't uh, wait that long for a high demand. Whoops. Even though there'll probably one come up soon, but we'll just uh, have to take her in, I guess, because I had to put myself a little bit into a bit of debt there to get that uh, head attachment for this thing. So we are actually... 65,000 dollars of a loan there we gotta work on. Yeah. That's gonna be fun. But anyhow, the last field there will get set up with some barley. As well. Whoa, better not take that out too much. Some barley as well after. That's going to be too big for there. Ooh, crap. Close enough. <laughs> okay. Now, the other which place is paying more. That's what I want to know. Um, wheat at uh, 2.23... 247 at the saloon, that's where we're going. Just don't put a bridge in there, eh? Hmm. Pretty good money, you know. It's not too bad for being on hard. But we'll do pretty good next week when we ever get those fields off. Just flying! Look out! We're coming through! Holy crap! Alright, uh, uh, this will be the last thing we'll probably do today is, uh, what tractor we're going to use, what tractor we're going to use, let's use this guy again, oh, how am I going to get out of here, it's like that, <laughs> Yeah, if this will hook up to this, uh, we'll go pick up that stuff, and then, um, I don't, I'll probably actually, oh, it's not going to work with this one. It's got a low hitch, not a high hitch. Okay, well, that's the end of that one, then, so we'll go put that one back. Now, what is this one? Does this one have a high hitch? Yes, high and low. Slows down pretty quick. Must have a bearing season up somewhere. Oh. There's an issue here. A little issue here. That's not going to work. <laughs> Next.
Well, this one should work. Glad I got this this guy, because I don't know what I'd be doing otherwise, and I wouldn't be able to pick this stuff up, that's for sure. There, that's a little better match. Yeah, I want to get cows going here a bit, so I probably will take this right to their, right to their pen. And I'm sure they'll use her up. Even though I don't have any cows yet, but I could start buying a few, I presume. Probably be a good idea to do that to uh, get them started, anyways. I'm also gonna have to try to find some money for a mower too to start mowing and picking up some grass. At least we can feed them some grass. Uh, and for some reason, I don't know why the mowers are so expensive. See, it does turn nice, though. Eighty-nine percent. That's not too bad, you know. Uh, I got a little bit more yet here, I guess. And we are officially done. Ninety percent. I'm happy with that. So let's take this into uh, into their pen, and we'll stock their pen and get them ready for when we get the get the cattle. The moo cows. And then, uh, we shall reseed that field and we will be finished. So, got all this grass in here I can cut too, eh? Like, there's lots of grass. in a pond. Oh, it's enough for six days. That's good. 
Now, what should I do with the rest of this? I guess... Maybe what I'll do is start a pile, like, right here. Is that going to work now? Yeah, I should be able to do that. Alrighty. They are good. Look, we got a fake cow guy in here. Oh, crap, that didn't go too well. Total fail. My fault. All right. Let's leave that fella there. Let's spin it around here, and we'll try our seeding and cultivating seeding officially 25% seed I think Let's see how far that'll go for us see how far that'll go Might actually get the whole field done. I don't know. Oh, it's gonna be real fun trying to. Well, I guess I can see the whiskers there from the other stuff, but it's gonna be tricky uh, keeping that in line. Interesting. Too bad, I guess. Yeah, that seed is going down. That's good. It's kind of neat. Man, I missed some. Pretty good view there-ish somewhere. Still see the whiskers there, and then I guess overlapping a little bit's not going to hurt too much. I do keep missing bits though, but anyways. I guess pretty much if you keep your tractor running up the edge of the fur there, roughly it, you know, overlaps a hair a little bit, but that's probably not hurting.
Seven percent left. I don't think we're gonna quite make her, boys. Pretty much gone. Finish this roll. Okay. So we'll head her back over and put a little more seed in and uh, finish that up. Actually, whoa, whoa. Oh, now I did her. It's actually going to keep burning up seed. Oh, it does too. Man. Here I thunk I was doing good and then screwed her. Oh well. I can fix that after I just have to do it without the cultivator on, but not a huge big deal. Technically, in a real farming situation like that should still grow anyways, but I bet you it won't in the game here. We should actually... Uh, Try that after. Twenty percent should finish that. I think we got maybe two more passes and we are good. Good to go. 
Hopefully I got enough seed here. Man, I thought 20% would have done her for sure, but now I'm having second thoughts almost on it. Okay, let's take this off. Get that off. We'll just dip her back in the field here and fix these little spots we messed up. We should have enough there. Seriously. Now, why won't this thing lift? Fold sore X. Maybe it'll lift after we fold it. A lift sore V. Nope. That's all she's got. That's kind of dumb. That means you can't drive back too fast. <laughs> What do we got left in our spreader here? Are we going to have enough to... Oh, yeah, I think we should. Ooh, well, maybe not. Really hard to say. Maybe we will. <laughs> Better after how much this stuff costs us. Holy. Fertilizer's not cheap. Just about got her. 
Oh, that's awesome. Good enough. All right. We are complete for this week. That was a lot of farming, a lot of manual labor for what we uh, what we got accomplished. But wow, we it's. I guess they say it's rewarding. I don't know. It seems like a lot of work to me, but yeah, maybe next week. Is this fertilized? Yeah. Uh, maybe next week we'll start using our old Harold again. He uh, sure saves us a lot of messing about. And there we go. Well, thanks for watching this week. Uh, it was a lot of work, like I say, but uh, sometimes that's the way you gotta do her. Oh, look at that. Sweet. So, yep, yeah, there's our uh, livelihood sitting out there just waiting for us for next week. And uh, we'll get harvesting and uh, trying to make a bunch of money and get our cows going again and uh, try to reestablish the old farm. But anyways, thanks for watching this week. We'll catch you next week for some more Farm Sim Saturday.